I was scared for my life because of every boom you Like, they wanted to. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you come and subscribe to my YouTube channel and subscribe to my YouTube channel, and hit the notification bell so as to get notified when we upload new videos and to my returning subscribers you guys are the real mvps my dears <laughs> yeah so take the front seat sit down and enjoy like suit yourself don't forget to grab your popcorn as we listen to this gist here for you because this topic hey, hmm. oh my god <laughs> yeah this topic says my experience as a teacher never again I'm no longer a teacher. Will we make call? <laughs> well, this is not to spite teachers and this is not to say ill things or to paint teaching profession bad. This is just my own experience, like the topic said, my experience. So if you're into the teaching profession, this is not saying what you guys are doing is bad or something. No. Mm -mm. If you're aspiring to be a teacher, my dear, if you love it, please go for it. Yeah, that's what I'll just tell you. But as for me, I am not a born teacher. Teaching is not for me. <laughs> yeah, so let's get down into this video. And yeah, before we continue, let's I forget. Along the line, if you are a teacher, an aspiring teacher or anything, or you've taught before, or you are teaching, mm -hmm, or the English join, please, eh? Let me know in the comment section below your experience as a teacher or how it has been. You no, know, stuff like that. Mm, thank you and God bless you. So, yeah, um, before I started teaching, I was the deputy bossa in my dad's school. Yeah, so along the line, um, we had a vacancy to, for civic education. So, and I was to take up the role and before that i was like they should get someone else that i can't teach like i'm not a born teacher i can't teach so they looked for someone else and um the person they got was an aspiring core member like a pmc pcm pmc so i don't know what they call that thing i beg so <laughs> that's how <laughs> the person came and i guess the person spent one month and service called and he left and i was the only person that was to take up the role so i was like okay and <laughs> there i was thinking i would take js1 and js2 classes because you know js1 and js2 they are just entering secondary school from primary school and they are still tender and like their mind is still soft can tell them this and they will do it and all like that so i was like ah, i guess it's a type of people i can handle unknown to me that Hmm. Unless you got a greater plans for me, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know how to put it. But lo and behold, I was to take JS3 to SS3. So I was like, ah, oh God, I can't do this. I made the admin, so I can't do it. I was like, Miss Taye, but in school, they, they, at work, they call me Miss Taye or Miss Praise. Well, the students call me Miss Praise. Some of the staffs call me Miss Praise. The admin call me Miss Taye. He was like, Mr. E, you can do it, and blah, 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 I said. And he was like, you know, SS3 and JS3, they are writing, they're preparing for exams, so you don't have much work for them. It's SS1 and 2, they have much work, so you just say you have just two classes they are taking. So I was like, okay, I accepted it in good faith. He told me on a Friday, that weekend, it was no weekend in at all, because I was thinking about it. Hmm. If I'm sleeping like this, I'll be like, how good, how good day inside class like this, how good they teach these children? Yeah, because... Um, SS2, SS1, and SS3 yeah, in that format. I'm close to them, so in that format. So, I was like, God, how will I teach the children? Just three students, and I was like, those ones are still small. Like, even though two of my siblings are in, in JS3, and one is in SS3, I was like, eh, go rock it down. Hmm. Oh my god. So, as I was saying, go, passion so long, mm. as we did talk to go. That's how I started teaching. Um, where I found difficulty was writing of lesson notes. Ah, it's it is tiring. Ah, teachers, I hear you guys. I don't know how you people do it. Writing of lesson notes is. Oh my god. <laughs> 
So, I, I was coping, Sha. Writing this notes every week. I was coping. Then, um, it got to, because the time I took up the role was towards the meeting break time. So, and a lot of things happened. So, I had to cover a lot. Like, so I met, I met up, though. I met up and my first impression teaching was good yeah my first impression was good the students were receptive they were very happy oh miss praise miss praise if we teach you know, I was like they were very happy when i go to their classes and everything like that ss2 was one of my best class followed by ss1 then followed by gs3 ss1 then ss3 so along the line hmm, one day was what I do for them, especially for SS1 and SS2. I explain the notes, then I give them the notes to copy. So one of the days I had explained the notes in SS1, I had explained the notes, and it was time for them to copy the notes. So I decided to sit down in the class while they copy the notes so that they would finish copying that note because most times they don't copy the notes, they just know how students behave. They will just while they wait the period without doing anything, they will come and return the notes. You man, we are done. Uh. So I decided to sit in the class. So they will copy the notes because the next week was another topic. So hmm, we are in the class, and one thing I liked about um, SS1 students, they are very very interactive when it comes to question and answer. They ask questions and they answer questions a lot. So that day. They were writing the notes and the class was quiet because I was there. On a norm, I said, one student are always making notes. So, they were writing the notes and I don't know the spirits that entered one of them and he started talking. He said, Ah, oh God, why must we even copy your notes? If this note is too much, it is this and that and that. Ah, the class goes, why must, why must we even do civic education safe? Ah, can you not remove it from the curriculum? Eh? Ah, the class is boring. The teacher goes safe is boring. And I was doing everything. I was sitting at the back. I was doing everything. Momo, I shock. I was like, it was as if the ground should open and swallow me. So that's he will not know that I am in the class. So he will not know that I won't hear anything. So, God, just shouted, Ah, don't you know that Miss Priest is in class and you are seeing this thing like this? Uh -uh, she's more boring now. The class is interesting. I said, It's a lie, but she's not in class. As I see her at the back. And he turned back and he saw me. Shouted, Yeah, I don't enter my room. My man was like, Oh, really? John, they run your mouth, they talk, they yarn rubbish. Mm. Inside me, I was hard. Oh, God, hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, these people say, Make a con teach you. If not, I'm going to hear this kind of trash with this picking, this small picking they talk from my side. It was right in front of me. Hi, God. I was like, Ah, come, 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 come. What's in the happen? So, to console myself, Sha, I was like, Well, yeah. I don't talk about before. I've already said it before that I'm not a born teacher. So, but ah, the boring parts. Hey, my people, am I boring? Yeah, sometimes I can be shy, right? Mm, sometimes I I know I own up to it. Sometimes I can be boring. I know that <laughs> it is very shy. God is helping our ministry. Hmm. So that day I was just like God. Yeah, it was as if the ground should open and swallow me. Hmm. Before I continue my story, if you are a teacher, if you are in my issue, what will you do to that student? The student was sitting in front of you and the student yanda rubbish. What are you go do? Will you beat the child? Will you? <laughs> Because at that point, I didn't know what to do. I just kept quiet. I kept mute. And I was just staring at the board as though I was, my mind was there. Well, oh my God, I was thinking of a lot. Like, I was so I mean, I this, now I made this small picking around streets like this. Ha! Ah, oh my God. Mm. I just kept quiet. I was looking. So it was like, it's a lie, Josh. She did not hear me. Ma, did you hear what I said? I was just looking at him like this. My mind was like, oh, what is the idea? I don't turn to deaf person when we hear waiting to talk. Hmm. So he continued writing his notes. All of a sudden, his colleague said, Miss Prince, you should go and kneel down. I said, in my mind, I was like, eh? Kneel down. Ah, hey, if you need down, you need down for himself. I need to you stood up, you went to kneel down. <laughs> oh my god. He went to kneel down. He knelt down for like 10, 
10 minutes. I said, Free them. Serve your punishment. Since I don't even know what to do to you. But if your students, if your colleagues punish you, huh? they are justified. They are fighting for me. <laughs> so, all of a sudden, they say, laughing. Ah, Miss Prince did not say she need that. No, we are the ones that say she need that. You two will be saying rubbish like that. We went to sit down. That one passed. They finished writing the notes. The period closed. I packed myself. I left their class. Mm. He came to miss me again. Ma, I'm sorry. I don't see him sign. He came to my office. I didn't sign. I just remember I was like, I don't even know what to do to you. Because ah, please if you if you're a, if you're a teacher, eh, and somebody do something like that, what would you do? Please, I want to know in the comment section <laughs> because that day, ah God, I didn't know what to do. Yeah, I was just like, yeah. Everybody have their mouth to talk. <laughs> and I know some people, some teachers, or will I say lecturers in the university, what they will do, eh? they will not touch their students. They will not even, see, they will not even exchange words or anything. Mm -mm. Now for the result, the person will see him. I know what I'm saying. But, um, he's a very brilliant student, so there's no how if I do anything to the result, they will not know. So. And why should I even do that? If I wanted to, if you want to do something, it's not offend you just as in say to the person, let the person like have you should have that conversation, not being evil for evil. How do they say it? Yeah, so that one passed. Then meet and break came, and when it's um meet and break, we give them assignments so that they don't go home to just play and come back and they don't remember anything the first thing. So SS2 students and other classes, I give them assignments to take home, take home assignment, that's what they call it. So after they resume from meeting break, hmm, my wonderful SS2 students, they did not do the assignments at all. They didn't do it. All of them came back and they were copying themselves. This one copied this one, this one copied this one. And I was like, okay. So because of that, they didn't submit the day they were supposed to submit. I gave them the grace. They submitted the next day. And I already gave them AOC for their tests. I'm finished marking their assignments. Like I was like, I was just marking for marking sake because they don't give me joy at all. And I was I was so disappointed because ah, it was my one of my best class. And I'm like, ah, I expected much from you guys now. Why? Mm. I don't know. Say, what she what she my year ball. Oh, I bet you see that you're what ah. Mm. That one pass so. It was time for tests, and I had already finished marking their scripts for assignments. So I took it to their class. I gave them their test. When they were done with their test, I collected their scripts and I shared the assignment to them. That was when I. That's when Yawa gas. I mean, I didn't say that. <laughs> ah, Jesus, that day. So it was even I should carry it to fire. I should carry me away. Class that is well ventilated. Hmm. Like well ventilated. I was soaked in my own sweat. It was as if the rain beat me that day. Ah, oh, God. I finished sharing this, this two grand scripts. And they didn't get up to the score they thought they would get because they copied themselves and everything like that and blah, blah. They're like, Ma, this is not my score. I know what I'm supposed to score. I guess, they, yeah, it was over 20. I'm like, ma, I know what I'm supposed to score. This is not my score. I'm supposed to get 2020. Am I supposed to get to 19? Ma, is the only one I'm supposed to pay? Hey, ma, this one, ma, Miss Prezi, you don't know how to mark. You don't know. And I was like, you know, Isha, one leg. I kept quiet. I was still even laughing with them as far. We are parties. We used to be very rare and everything. I was still laughing with them. I was like, uh uh. She you don't know what's your roots. Yeah, check your notes. She, I, I was my phone. I go, went online. Yeah, check this one. Yeah, okay. I made an answer that they made me say, Ah, ma, it's true. Mama, just pity us now. Ah, ma, so that we will not fail. Blah, 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 blah. I said, hmm? No. La, no. I am not doing anything of such. Because when you get to the exam, you are going to SS3. External exams, they would not pardon you whatsoever you write is what they will mark and everything like that. so we are preparing you for that level it's a man now ah. now then came and said ma you don't know how to mark how will you give me this type of score me of all people i'm like who are you 
That's all of this I say. Ah, ma, she is this. She is. She they, they see her as one of the brilliant people in class, and she scored lower than everybody. And I'm like, okay. So does that now mean I don't know how to mark? Like, I don't understand. Come and see the. I was in their middle. They were shouting at me. They were ah, talking and saying all sorts of rubbish from their mouths. And I was like, hey, God. Mommy, these people, they run straight like this. So, you send me work, make I come they teach. Let me send myself work. Because I was like, ah, guy, confess to. I sat down there. I didn't even know what to say. Like, I was scared for my life because of every boom, like they wanted to eat me. I was scared for my life. Oh, ah, no, 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 jokes apart. I was, I was scared for my life. I was like, God, this shouldn't can go violent and beat me up. <laughs> hey, because apparently most of them are bigger than me. So, <laughs> what would I say happen? Hey God, have mercy. My man, I was just like, hey, a teacher, a star should just pass and come and rescue me. Or something should just happen. Or I should just disappear. Like, different things were running through my mind. And I was like, teacher is not coming. Nothing is happening. I'm not disappearing. Hey, hey, my I just, I took, like, oh my God. I don't know where that strength and courage came from inside me. I just shouted at them. Oh God. Me that I don't get voice. My voice is tiny. Hey. I stood up. I shouted at them and I was like, all of you should get out of this place. Are you serious at all? So you are trying to tell me that I don't know what I'm doing. I finished talking out and kept quiet. They were looking at me. This place we are sorry. I said, keep your sorry to yourself. Who do you who, who do you think you are trying this nonsense with? Can you try this with this person? Can you try? With, oh, because I've been gisting with people and laughing with people. That's okay. From this time on, nobody should come to my office. Nobody. I talk finish. You. No more. Ah, means I finished talking. I did pack my things. Means I finished talking. I left their off their class. I went straight to my office. I got I got to my office. I was shaking because when I was there, I was dripping sweat like this to tell you how hey. Oh God! So you how intense it was. Huh. It was good. I brought me out too because I don't know my brethren. I don't know my sisters and my brother. I don't know what my family members. I don't know what. I don't know what would have happened to me. Hmm. I got to my office. I was shaking. Like I was literally shaking. I wanted to mass scripts. Biro was falling from my hand. Ha! Huh. I was like, hey, ha, God of creation. I was shocked. I go to the office, they were asking me, my sister was asking me that, what happened? Where are you coming from? I could not talk. Like, I was shaking. Hey, 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 hey. You know, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, I've never been in such position before. So I don't even know how to describe it. Ha! Ha! I could not explain to anybody what happened. I could not see it. I was not wondering that way to me. Ha! So, all this shouting and everything was good. Nobody even came outside to say, What is happening? No. What? Ah! So, if they won't kill me, I said they go kill me for inside that class. Hmm. Mama, it wasn't funny. But I did not be in. The Lord was on my side. Oh, I did not be. Hey, the Lord was on my side. Oh my God, Sanu Boame, the anger of the enemy would have swallowed me alive. Hey, Oluwa, I did not be. The Lord was on my side. Ah, God, Daddy. Ah, oh. And I was so glad that that was my last time stepping my feet into their class, like going to teach. Because after meeting break, they just did revision and stuff like that. And that was all. I, I, before meeting, I already finished their syllabus. And I was so glad. 
when it was a vacation week i just told him eh i know i cannot come to i was like i was still scared to go to their class i was scared like if i enter their class hope they will not bring up the this thing again because, I was scared to enter their class. I was so scared. I, I was so scared. I've never been that scared in my life. Ah, Omo. It was like horror movie. Hey. Please repeat after me. Never again. Ah, hey, 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 hey. God. I was so scared. I was so scared. I was so scared. Ah, no. I didn't enter their class again. No. I said, I don't teach. Thank you. I don't do. You are coming to me. Say, Miss Praise, come and teach us. Come and do revision for us. Come and explain this. I said, eh, no. Meet your colleagues that understand. Or oh, go and read your book. I'm not doing. I cannot deal. It's not by force. Yo. I can't do. I can't. I gave them always AOC, AOC, area of concentration. Go and read your book. Don't meet me again. I'm not doing. Ah, eh, go and explain me. How many ask me how many is my body that they want to come and eat me? Ah, I beg you, please day your day, make I day my day. Eh, yeah, yeah, like yeah, ba. Ah, I say my man, I was like, ah, I beg, who send me teaching work? Teaching is not for me. All of you that are for teaching, please, I salute you. Eh, I salute you. You they teach? I salute you. You get courage. Hmm. You get courage. Ah, please. So, if you're a teacher, a professional teacher, a home teacher, a school teacher, a lesson teacher, please let me know in the comment section. How do you people copy ah, teachers? How do you cope? Like, no, like seriously now, because I am on. I'm like, I might have the opportunity to teach one. Okay, of course, when I give it to my own children, I would when they come home for. From um brain school, I would teach them and anybody that told me that wants to turn my head, I would leave the person passing. I beg. So please, how do you people do it, teachers? How do you cope with uh, like, I don't want to call them stubborn set of people or I don't know. I don't know the word to use. Ah my god. Teachers are really trying. I salute to people. Ah I give it to you. You guys are trying like you guys are trying you guys are trying you guys are trying eh ah no, no, no. never again only me call i said never again <laughs> oh yeah we've come to the end of the gist on my experience as a teacher so don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel and let me know your thoughts on this topic like let me know your experience if you have taught before if let me just know hmm? let me just just let me know in the comment section so that people that are aspiring to be a teacher they can learn from your experience also and when you find yourself in such in my shoe such situation what do you do like give us advice on what to do hmm? thank you very much and please ah enjoy Ah, what is wrong with you people, my brethren and my sisters? Eh? People should subscribe to my YouTube channel. Ah, if I check the people that are subscribed and the people and compare to the people that are viewing my channel, ah, the people that are viewing are more than the people that are subscribing. Eh, yo, ah, ah, you people are enjoying the premium jeans and you do not want to subscribe. What can far? Please and please, yo, I am begging you in the name of the Father and of the Son of the, of the Holy Spirit. Whatsoever you name, you know you are serving. I beg you in that name, oh, please, yo, come and subscribe to my youtube channel and uh, subscribe to my youtube channel so that we will not enter one shukoto because uh, you cannot be viewing my channel and be enjoying freemium just and you will not subscribe to my channel what's come far tell me what's come far let me not hear it oh. may it not be heard thank you very much we have come to the end of today's episode uh emmy's vlog thank you see we meet again bye bye